Okay. Uh, a document one represents the pedigree of a family whose certain members colored in black are affected by hemophilia B. This disease is observed only in male individuals. The presence of this gene in two copies in a genotype provokes the death of the embryo. So let's see what information we have first in the given. Okay, as in this pedigree, we have only males affected by hemophilia B. Okay, hemophilia B is a disease in the blood that causes the blood not to clot if you cut your skin or something like this. يعني ميوعة الدم بس ميوعة قوية جدا هيدي بتكون. Okay, this disease is observed only in males. طيب. The presence, the presence of this gene in two copies in the genotype provoke the death of the embryo. يعني if a person gets the two copies of the mutated gene, he will die. And that's why, okay, I'll, 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 we come to this. طيب, is this, is this, is this is the allele responsible for the disease, yeah, Jana, dominant or recessive? And they justify your answer. Dominant? Why? Lahza. If you have two copies or if the individual has two copies, it will he will die. Yes. طيب ممتاز بس نحن هون we have affected person يعني for sure those do not have the uh, copies the two copies yes بس mainly نحن we look as we said before to know if it is dominant or recessive we look to what we look to parents yes. and one of the children yes صح ف which parents yes. here you will you will discuss or you will talk about one or two or seven? One, two and seven. But one normal, two affected here. You cannot depend on this. Like, no, you, should take, you should take the two parents that are the same. Uh, three or four or ten? Uh, three or four or ten. But all normal, we did uh, oh, 8, 9, and 14. Uh, 8, 9, and 14. Okay, no problem. But now, logically, you search. Find for parents and the children. Okay, no problem. But now, logically, logically, you search for parents who are normal, having an affected child, in order to prove it is recessive. If you want to prove dominant, you search, you search uh, for affected, uh, uh, let's say, parents, okay, affected parents with normal ch children. Okay. Faisal Jana, how you write the answer? And the allele responsible for the disease is recessive. Why? Since uh, uh, the parents eight and nine uh, have an affected son uh, fourteen, uh, which uh, get, which um, get from his parent uh, X D Y D. Wait, 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 wait. We will not say now X D and Y D. We're talking about best recessive or dominant. We're not talking about localization. <laughs> How do you know <laughs> it is on X? Do you have information about being on X? <laughs> recessive. Recessive, okay, but it could be autosomal. Oh, okay, okay. So right? It could be autosomal. Yes. And not just an eight and nine on the affected son, so no, the disease is masked in eight and nine. Okay, we say fourteen is affected. His parents yes. are healthy. Faisal, the defected uh -huh. allele is a present in the parent, but not expressed or masked. Yes. Read the answer, please. 
Okay, the allele responsible for hemoph hemophilia is recessive because individual 14 is hemophiliac and his parents, 8 and 9, are healthy. The defective allele is present in the parents but is not uh, expressed. Symbol H for hemophilia and N for healthy or non hemophilia. Just like this, we do not mention the X and the Y now. Okay, we're just talking about being recessive or dominant. To say recessive, we look at normal parents, both normal with affected child. To say dominant, affected parents and normal child. Yes. Okay? Clear for the others? Uh -huh. This is how we answer this type of questions. Okay. Thank you, Yajana. Welcome. Type. Let me go now to Muhammad. Yalla, ya Muhammad. Two. No, sir. Yalla, Muhammad. Number two, please. Is the uh, is this gene sex link justify the answer? Okay, you should say yes or no, and yes why you said no this. Yes or no, and why you said this. Tab, how we Tab, how we prove this here? Prove this here. It says in number deny. Deny. Very good, yeah. Deny. Yeah, very denying. good, yeah. Deny. First, you want to deny the first one. You want to deny the first one. Is the uh, non-homologous part of Y? Non-homologous part of Y. Non-homologous part of Y. Yala Muhammad, how you prove it? Yala Muhammad, how you prove it? If the affected allele is on non-homologous part of Y, every affected boy should have an affected father, but boy 14 has a normal father. Nine, so it is not the case. Very good, Ya Muhammad. Very good. Very good. So as in how I prove that it is not on the Y, we look for an affected son and we check uh, that his father should be also affected. Muhammad denied this by saying 14 is affected. His father, nine, is normal and he takes the Y from his father. So this is a proof that is not on the Y, on non-homologous part of Y. Also, Muhammad can depend on number two and his boys six and seven. It's too affected. But six and seven are what? Six and seven are normal. Tayyip Muhammad, very good. Tayyip, we deny this. Tayyip, can Muhammad deny for me that it is not autosomal from the text If uh, the affected allele is the autosomal, the disease should appear in both males and females. But all affected individuals are males, so it is not the case. Okay, this from the pedigree, Muhammad. Sah? It says, also, he said in the text that this disease is observed only in male individuals. Okay, but what did you say? I like the presence to the presence of this gene in two this copies gene in a in two copies. provokes the death of the embryo. Sah? Sah. For example, autosomal recessive to appear the disease on the individual he should he should carry both alleles but we have a number two and number 14 affected يعني أكيد they are not carrying both alleles okay they are not carrying both alleles فإذن for sure it is not autosomal Okay. 
اوكي استاذ هلا من ديناي لل هومولوجس بارت اوف اكس اند واي هومولوجس بارت دو يو هاف ميل اند هومولوجس بارت دو يو هاف ميل اند ميل افكتيف اونلي ميل اونلي اون ان ذا ميل اونلي اون ان ذا ميل اوكي طيب لوك هاو ذي طيب لوك هاو ذي روت ذا انسر Check with me this, please. Yes, 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 Anna. Yes, yes, Anna. Ma, ma, I'm very curious. How did you know that she was from the same chromosome? Wait, let him read the answer and then I explain. Hamad, you read the answer, please. Yes. Fadal. Fadal. Yes, because the presence of this gene in two copies provokes the death of the embryo. So it cannot be the hemophilic. So it cannot be autosomal. The hemophilic boy thus possesses possess one allele H, which is possible only if the inheritance is sex-linked and not autosomal. Therefore, this gene is found on a segment of sex chromosome which has no homologous segment on the other chromosome. Only. Okay. Faizan, now we deny Yajana that it is not autosomal. Lanu, he told me if you have or if someone has two copies of this gene. Okay, two copies of this gene, he will die. Faizan, and the boys here lived. Tab, how they lived? They lived because they have only one copy. طب استاذ ما هو الاساس ما المفروض يكون في اثنين كوبيز؟ لا اذا اثنين كوبيز they will not survive طيب لكن كيف الاساس لازم يكون عنده انه اكس دي اكس دي اكس دي اكس دي عم نحكي بويز نحن هون يا جنى اه قصدي انه اكس دي واي دي اكس دي واي دي يو بروف باي ذس انه على الهومولوجس بارت Oh, okay. But if he has the both copies, he will die and will not survive. And he will not see the boy. Okay? Yes, okay, please. For instance, to survive and be affected, you should have one copy only. How we can do this with one copy? For instance, for sure, it should be gonosomal or sex linked. Okay, gonosomal or sex linked. Clear? Okay, thank you, Muhammad. Taib, number three. Maryam. Yes, sisters. Okay, yalla. Indicate the genotype of each of the individuals 8, 13, and 14. Okay. Just the pie for each genotype the answer. Tayyib. Estes, who in half should tell me that no. Yeah, we're not sex linked. Yes. Yani, it will not be on the on the Y. Kamal, I know Muhammad proved that if it is on the Y, the parents. Should be uh, or an affected father should have should have an affected son, and he pro he, he denied this. Yes. Okay. Faizan, what will be uh, uh, Maryam the genotype of the mother eight? It says X A X D. X N X D or X N X H. Now we give N for the normal capital, H for the small. Okay. Very yes. good. X N, X H. Because she is normal, صح? Yes. But she has an affected boy fourteen. Will boy usually take X from his mother? Yes. So then she should be carrying the allele, the affected allele. Type. Concerning thirteen, what do you say about thirteen? It says X. 
اوكي لا لا سوري الاكس يعني النورمال اكس ان مريم اكس ان نورمال اكس اتش افكتد استاذ الواي بس بنقول واي ولا بنقول واي دي لا ما في واي دي هون بس واي لانه هو اون اون اكس يس هو اون اكس بتكون اكس ان واي فاذا النورمال بوي اكس ان واي يس Yes, as his father is normal. Okay. Yeah, uh, can you read the answer, please? Yes. Individual A is XN, XH, since she is healthy. Being healthy, she must have the allele N, but since her father is sick, he gives her an XH. Individual 13 is XNY, since he is healthy from a disease on non-homologous non segment of X. Individual 14 is XHY since he is sick by a disease on non-homologous -hom segment of X. The genotype of female 5 is the same as that of female A, XN, XH since her father is sick. It says in the message, look at the phone. Sorry, let's put in 5 on. The genotype of 5 same as 8. لا 5 is far here from here. Ah, from the next question. طيب, continue يا مريم, please, number 4. Make the necessary analysis to determine the possible proportions of the descendants of female 5 in each of the following cases. Female 5. Yes. If her husband is not affected by hemophilia. طيب اولا شو الجينوتايب لل5 فيميل ان اكس اتش اكس ان اكس اتش واي لانه هي انه هي هيلثي واخده من هير فاذر اوكي فاذا شي توك اكس فروم هير فاذر وهي هيلثي يس اوكي فيري جود طيب Okay, so يعني هي X N X H و her husband is not affected. يعني X N Y. Yes. طيب. What what will be? استاذ بيطلع عنا genotype of parents أول شيء منكتبون إنه هن X N X H times X N Y. الجامت بيكونوا X N و X H و X N و Y. Okay. Give me the final result. Is this hundred percent normal? Is that how normal? He they will not have a hemophilic children. No. Le. استاذ لانه الديزيز هو ريسيسيف اوكي ريسيسيف بس الماذر هير 5 هي اكس ان اكس اتش استاذ يعني 75% و 25 وي هير وي هاف تو ديفرنشيت بتوين بويز اند جيرلز صح؟ يس yes. هقول لك ليش لانه نحن عندنا المذر هون اكس ان اكس اتش صح؟ يس هير هازبند نورمال يعني اكس ان واي يعني ذا فاذر ويل جيف ذا جيرلز اكس ان ويل جيف هيز دوترز اكس ان يس اوكي طيب معناتها all his daughters will be normal لأنه الـ XN dominant صحيح؟ 
Yes. طيب. He will give his daughter, his boys, why? Will mother will give the boys y x n y x h? Is this يعني the girls one hundred percent normal? Okay. Will boys percent abnormal or fifty percent normal? Okay. تمام. Yes. طيب. Or in case the father is affected. Any case, any? Yes. استاذ هلا هنا انه معنى انه اذا مثلا التو جينز التقوا ان تو كوبيز بيكون انه ديف بيكون ديف صحيح فهون بيكون عندنا 25% ديف اوكي خلينا نشوف الفيرست كيس لايكي اكس ان اكس اتش اكس ان واي وي دو ذا تيبل بيطلع معنا 1 اوفر 4 هيلثي One over four healthy girl, one over four healthy normal girl not carrier, one over four healthy boy, one over four hemophilic boy. Yes. Okay. In the second case, X N X H the female, X H Y. Come on, we do the table. We get hemophilic girl born dead. Healthy carrier girl, healthy boy, hemophilic. Boy. Yes. Okay. Yes. Type the others. Any question about this? We all understand how we do this. طيب very good thank you يا مريم هلا يلا another volunteer رنا can you answer for us or can you continue استاذ عثماني yes أكيد Okay, we perform a special technique for the analysis of DNA of the couple 8, 9 and their children 12, 13 and 14. Okay. We obtain different DNA fragments of variable length measured in kilo bases. Yes, document bases, two. yes. By referring to document 2, identify the allele of the hemophilia E. Okay. Which allele, the 1.8 KB or the 1.3 KB, is the one responsible for hemophilia, Yavana? Which one you think is responsible for hemophilia? The 14. Okay. The 1.3. 1.3, very good, Yavana. 1.3. But then, also, we can notice something else. And no, the females have always two copies, yani two bands. صح. بينما الميل عم يكون عندهن one band only. يعني أكيد هو على X هون. يعني هذا another proof كمان إنه على X. فإذا لاحظ يا منا ال 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 male nine. And the one band on 1.8, yani hey, the X N. The female 12 has two copies. 1.8, the X N, 1.3 X H, yani he a female carrier. The 13 normal male, and the best X N. 14 affected male, and the best 1.3, best X H. Will uh, will mother eight? Will he a carrier and the X N or X H? Good, Yavana. Can you read the answer, please? Yes. The comparison between electrophoresis nine and thirteen of healthy man on one hand and the electrophoresis of individual fourteen hemoph 
hemophilic, hemophiliac man, on the other hand, permits to say that the radioactive band of 1.3 kb, which characterizes the allele H, is responsible of hemophilia B. Okay. Bye. Let's continue, Yavana, together, if I can. Document three show what? Document three presents the karyotypes of an individual with an abnormality, while document four presents the karyotype of a normal individual. Five. Six, compare these two karyotypes. What is the abnormality revealed? Okay. Yala Yavana, if we compare them, usually in compare, we start usually with what Yavana? Similarities. Similarities. Very good. Five and here. Uh, yes. Here. Okay. What do you want to say, Evana? Uh, Anna, twenty-one pairs equal. Okay. The first twenty-one pairs. La, twenty-one pairs. Then the first twenty. First the twenty are the same. With 22, come the same. But then I know we had female, we had male, had the differences. Exactly. Oh, another difference. Should anomaly you see here, Auntie? For three chromosomes, the pair number 21. The AU document? Document 3. Document 3. Should I see this abnormality? Trisomy 21. Trisomy 21. Very good, Yavana. Read the answer, please. The, karyoty the karyotype of the normal individual shows that the sex chromosomes X and Y, all its autosomes are present in pairs, while the karyotype of the affected individual shows the sex chromosomes X and X. All its autosomes are present in pairs except chromosome 21 that exists in three copies, trisomy 21. Trisomy 21, very good. Okay, very good. Type. Continue, uh, Lana, please. Document 5 is a karyotype of uh, spermatocyte 2 that is obtained from a man of a normal karyotype. This spermatocyte 2 is identical to that which has allowed the birth of the individual affected by the abnormal, abnorm abnormality document 3. 7. What information does document 5 provide? Okay, document 5 tells you what? What do you see in the document five? I had a karyotype of the uh, spermatocyte. One, the pair 21, and the two chromosomes. So this indicates that the abnormality in one. Ah, uh, and here, and I should have one copy in 21. Yes. But I have how many copies? Two. Okay, I have two. As an abnormality is now from the spermatocyte. Document 5, the present yes. karyotype of spermatocyte to each chromosome exists in one copy, except chromosome 21, which exists in two copies only. Okay. I make a label diagram of the anaphase stage of the division which produced this type. Okay, we do not draw all the chromosomes, only best present only in the diagram the sex chromosome with X and Y. Now, do you think, yeah, Rana, the problem here, hey, be a you and a phase, will one or a bit two? Bit two. Will and a phase two? Other than will and a phase two, what fail to separate? يعني مين اللي ما بيقدر يبعد عادة بالأنا فيز 2 السيستر كروماتيدز صح؟ يس yes. yes. بينما if you see the two copies of chromosomes معناتها البروبلم وين يا يا رنا؟ أنا فيز 1 اه اوكي اوكي whenever you see the two copies Mata the problem in anaphase one. Okay? okay, you get it? Yes. 
Okay, very good. Very good. So the problem in Anna phase one, instead of homologous chromosomes separating, the separation happens where? The separation happens in Anna phase one, uh, sorry, no separation in Anna phase one. So that's why the two chromosomes come together here. Okay, very good. Time. Okay. Is this clear for you guys all? Yes. Time. Rana, would you please read the, the answer? Draw only on a phase one showing separation of X from Y and the migration of the two chromosomes 21 to sample. Time. Why, Rana, I said here and a separation of X from Y? Nonsense. Why, I said separation of x and y why do you think they said this mm, i don't know male i know male i'm sperm yes we're talking about a sperm now i'm talking egg site egg cell no can x x Okay, can XX, صحيح. تمام, very good. Thank you, Yavana. Welcome. Fine. Any other question, guys? Anything we don't understand? From these questions? Is this? Yalla. استاذ فيك بس ترجع هيك توضح انه الفرق بين هومولوجس و نون هومولوجس لان كثير عم ضيعتين طيب when when i say when i say يا مريم homologous chromosomes this mean these chromosomes they have to be same size centromere position and the gene they carry together okay yeah بينما النون هومولوجس they may have, for example, different size. Yani, for example, yeah, Maryam, you tell me that no, X and Y are not homologous. Lano, they do not have the same size. They do not have the same size. For example, for sure, they are not homologous. But the two X chromosomes, you can say they are homologous. X for sure homologous. The X is. Okay. Because they have the X is. They have same size. Okay. They have, for example, uh, same centromere position and same genes. Okay. But we said that we said that in the Y. بالواي والاكس في عنا بارت بتكون هومولوجس صحيح في عنا بارت ويل بي هومولوجس وفي بارتس ذات ار نوت هومولوجس استاذ وكيف بنعرف نفرق بينهم طولي بالك هلا انا فيرست اي ويل شو يو هلا ان ايمج of a homologous chromosomes. Okay, hello, Anna, I, I am opening now. Just give me a second. I am opening now a, a page containing image of homologous chromosomes. Okay, Yalla, one second, Bess. Okay, hmm. let me share this. You see, Mariam? <coughs> same size, same centromere. You see the centromere where it is in the first one and the second pair, and same genes, same coloring. For these are homologous for sure. 
hundred percent. Yes. Type. Let's look now for the homologous chromosomes X and Y. They have homologous areas. Okay? Masalan, <laughs> look at this one. Khalini Amel Shev, look at this one. Maryam, you see this figure? It's had all X and Y. The yellow part is the common between them. How do you common? Meaning how do you homologous? How do you homologous part mean mean that X will Y? And do they have the same size? No. No. ما عندهم same size. فإذا that's why في عندك part اللي هي ال yellow هيدي homologous بين ال X وال Y يعني هيدي مثلها مثل ال autosome same as autosome. وعندك ال red part هيدي non homologous لل X. وعندك ال purple part هيدي non homologous لل Y. استاذ بس اذا مثلا كان عندنا اكس ثاني حتكون نفس الشكل الاول اكس صح صح هون لما يكونوا اثنين اكسز جنب بعضهم اجباري اللي موجود هون اجباري يكون موجود هون يعني استاذ هو بس حيكون نون هومولوجس اذا عم نشوف بين الاكس والواي اكيد اكيد صح. لما بدي احكي بنون هومولوجس بارت بكون عم قارن بين اكس وواي استاذ نعم لك ليش من قلنا هومولوج سيجمنت اوف اكس لانه لانه يا جنى لما اقول this جين از فاوند اون ذا نون هومولوجس بارت اوف اكس يعني انا قصدي this قليل على على الريد بارت اوكي does not have an opposite on the y اوكي اه اوكي عرفتي كيف؟ okay. مش هيك انت بتقولي لي اكس ان واي او اكس اتش واي يعني الان او الاتش ار لوكيتد ان ا بليس اون ذا اكس كروموزوم يو دونت فايت ذيم او يو دونت فايت ذا اوبوزيت اون ذا واي يعني لما بنحكي نون هومولوج سيجمنت اوف اكس بنكون عم نحكي عن ميل نون non homologous segment of x يعني it is found here on the red part no opposite لا على ال y yes بس قصدي انه ممكن عم نحكي عن ميل لانه في x و y ما حتكون x و x ايه اكيد لما بدنا نبرهنا بنبرهنا ب male مش ب مش ب ب female yes okay okay clear استاذ كليب وضحت لكم كل شيء؟ فاذا وي اول ناو هلا نحن وي اندرستاند عن الاكس والواي يعني مثلا اف يو ريمبر ذا اكزامبل اي تولد يو بيفور اباوت ذا بولدنس اللي هو الصلع هذا از فاوند وير is found on non homologous part of y says بس في بنات عندهم صلع هيديك ما بيكون جينيتيك يا مريم اوكي ليكون يكون ستريس ممكن يكون هرمونز ممكن يكون مثلا نقص فيتامينز يعني في في عندك كثير كوزز ستريس في يكون ميوتيشن ولا ما ممكن كمان ميوتيشن بس لما نحكي مثلا نحن الجينيتيك بولدنس يعني بتشوفي الميلز كلهم اوكي يعني نون اوف ذيم اسكيب ذيس كميل يس اوكي اوكي وضحت فمثل ما حكينا هلا نحن قلنا الهيموفيليا برهلنا اياها محمد انه عن نون هوموجوس بارت اوف اكس فصار مجرد ما الميل حصل على 1 قليل يعني اكس اتش وحده 
هيطلع هيموفيليك بينما كفيميل اجبار يكون عندها الاثنين لتطلع هيموفيليك لانه هي ممكن تاخذ الاكس ان او ممكن تاخذ الاكس اتش فاجبار يكون في عندها اثنين كوبيز فلتكون هي هيموفيليك اجبار ترجع لشو ترجع للجينو تايب بدنا نشوف شو في عندها يس اوكي كلير يس اني كويستشن لا اذرز اني ثينج طيب Okay, uh, guys, they are saying in the school that we are going to have test next week. Okay, فنحنا we will do a test, inshallah, in chapter three. Sis, كيف نعمل online? هنعمله اونلاين لما عندنا حضور ما فينا نعمل حضور ما فينا نروح على المدرسه بس بس اذا عملنا مثل هذيك المره انه مثلا آه انه مالتيبل تشويس مسيف مالتيبل تشويس ايه عن جد طيب حقلكم شغله حقلكم شغله حنجرب نعمله مالتيبل تشويس حنخليه مالتيبل تشويس بس حنطول التايم شوي استاذ بس ما تخلي تايمينغ لكل سؤال خلينا نقدر نرجع عليه ونفكر و طيب خليني حجرب اعمله مش بالاي سكول اوكي حجرب اعمله بالجوجل فورم الجوجل فورم نحن وي كان كنترول ذا تايم ايه صح اوكي يكون احسن بنجرب نعمله جوجل فورم ونحن وي كنترول ذا تايم استاذ بهيدي التشابتر حنعمله بالثري شو رايكم؟ اي وحده كانت الميوتيشن اللي فيه عن الميوتيشن ايه اوكي اوكي سيز يعني هيدا باخر درس عم ناخده او اللي قبله؟ لا التشابتر اللي قبل هيدا ايه يس اوكي مش الحال؟ يس اوكي فاذا خلص بنعمله لكم بالميوتيشن فاذا بنحدد انا التايم بشوف مع الاداره امتى فينا نحجز اوكي وبخبركم ان شاء الله باذن الله طيب اني اذر كويستشن يلا ثانك يو فور يور اتندنس السلام عليكم